Dutch music used to have this show called Electric Circus, and it was a Friday night show live on Much Music on the corner of Queen and John, and you have these party people, but inside you had the hired people. They were hired to keep the party going. They were all dressed up uh, in snazzy club wear and, you know, looking hot and doing their thing on boxes and, you know, had glitter makeup on. So a friend's band, the Vanna Santilli's band at the time, uh, Bass's Bass was playing. And they asked us to just hang out with them backstage during rehearsal. This was dress rehearsal. So we stuck around, we were there. But the problem is, we were hung over that day, woke up and went there in our sweats. No lie, I was wearing the sweatsuit I was sleeping in that night. So there we were hanging out at Much Music in sweatpants and hoodies. And bass is bass, it's like, yo, we're gonna go get some dinner and then come back. But we're like, nah, we'll just chill here. We're in the Much Music building, we're not gonna leave now. <laughs> so uh, the host, Monica something or other at the time. Diol? Monica Diol, good memory. Monica Diol comes out and sees these two dudes. And you know, immediately she's like, what are these guys doing here? And I remember just at that second that Monica Diol is an original Winnipeg. So I just go, we're from Winnipeg. She goes, oh, come into my dressing room, come hang out. So we were hanging out with Monica Diol in her dressing room and she's getting her makeup done and all this stuff. And uh, then it's time for the show. The show's actually getting started. Lights are up, everyone's makeup's done and costumes done. So we thought we'll go to the side and watch the show. So as we were heading out of Monica's dressing room to go to the side and check the show out, the file of dancers were coming out. So we literally got squished into this line and pushed onto the set in sweatpants. And I swear, man, the gravy from my fries was on my hoodie. <laughs> Like right here, I'll never forget that because I I scooped my fries up with the gravy and it dipped down and it like drooped on my oh, it was nasty. So there I was with a hoodie and sweats and same with spits in the much music environment, getting ready to film the show. So you know everyone's starting to dance and you know it was like uh, there, there was this one very flamboyant guy that said. Uh, okay, everyone, I want energy. I want energy from all of you. Energy. And remember, don't sing in the camera. It's very tasteless. It's, it's not a good thing. Don't sing and look into the camera. So, you know, we missed that pep talk. So, Bass's Bass's track at the time was called Funkmobile. And we were just, you know, grooving, grooving, whatever. And it was playing and everyone was dancing. And as the camera would pan to us, we forgot the instruction because we weren't in the, the pep talk anyway. So as the camera came around, we were like, riding in my phone mobile, blah, 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 blah. and we forget the name, and we forget how the song goes, and we really, really looked bad. But by the time we got home to Winnipeg, we were heroes. It was in the newspaper. People were giving us high five. Even on the subway in Toronto, they were giving us high five. They just saw it on TV. We made fools of ourselves, but people needed that uh, reality, I guess, because everything was so, so shiny and glittery. But there we were. I was wearing this Converse hoodie, just bleh, <laughs> with a gravy stain. Yeah. yeah! It was a good time. Humble, <laughs> humble beginnings. Humble beginnings, alright. Showbizmonkeys.com